music you can see, we're at Winter Nam. I ran into DJ Silky D from KJLH, then KDAY. Yes, from K-Day, your first female mix master of K-Day. Also the first female, really, on the West Coast as being a female DJ. I started in 78. Uh, recorded music with Uncle Jam's Army, the famous group with uh, Egyptian Lover. Uh, <laughs> I do a lot of things, right? As a first woman audio owner, Secret Weapon Sounds, also was a first woman soundstage music director, provided the sounds with a 17-man crew for Boosie, Shaka Khan, uh, yeah, Cameo, Gap Band, Tina Marie, had a chance to do that for two years, and I'm an ambassador for Universal Hip Hop Museum right now. And that's now. what you're doing right now. And you're also representing your daughter. Oh, yes. My daughter, DJ Spark, who she happened to be Layla Hathaway's DJ, but she was the first youngest with Immature, B2K, Amarion, Marcus Houston, and a whole many others. You can check out OneDJSpark.com. And what are you doing these days? You're the ambassador for the hip hop. Explain the museum. Well, the museum is the history, of course, of the culture of hip hop, which will be opening up for 2024 um, out there in New York, in Bronx, New York. Um, Curtis Blow, Chuck D, KRS One, all of the pioneers decided to come together to put our history there, as well as uh, community, the education, um, helping other artists to uh, help themselves actually of being to be able to find their royalties or anything else that has happened to them and to keep this culture going, why not? And to be involved with the communities of who we are. Uh, a lot of people don't know hip hop is higher in the power and helping and healing our people. So with that said, we're here on a global aspect. You know, even though the, the, the Fisher Museum is opening in Bronx, we're a lot of many annex along the United States as well as other parts of the world because when hip hop was happening, it was happening all over. And we want to make sure that their history is in there well. It's not just the East Coast, West Coast thing. But it had to start with us, right, to get that type of attention. So this is what I do as an ambassador. I uh, educate as well as speak on a lot of panels, try to get in touch with a lot of the, uh, the artists that are out here, whether it's fashion, graffiti, the DJing, the whole bit, to be involved and be on this mission to keep the culture of hip hop. Awesome. Yeah. You gotta write a book. You broke barriers on- I am on writing a book, as a matter of fact, yeah. Starting this year, uh, got a couple, I'm in like eight documentaries, but I'm starting my own documentary right now. You know, who I am and just grateful, man. Cause we're also involved with the health, health and wellness. A lot of us are older, like myself, right? And we have, so, unfortunately, some are no longer here. But the ones who are here, you know, have been having health challenges. But we are, are, are educating about that because I am a stroke survivor. I had a stroke last year. Oh, well, you recovered. Oh, well, I look recovered, right? But I'm still going through the challenges and educating and hoping to inspire others what to do to maintain their health after succumbing some type of uh, heart, brain, right our physical disabilities we got a lot that has went through the journey and be able to educate that uh, you know and not to get depressed or these type of things to keep them from not being who they are naturally born of yes so I fight for humanity right and I fight the, and definitely for the youth and the youth need to know who we are because although we're in the age of information everybody can learn anything they want to do they don't know the history of where it all came from. And that's the whole point of University Hip Hop Music. Do you have a website? How can people find you? Oh, one such queen on Instagram. I do have a website, but since my setback, I haven't, been, but you'll see it out there. You will see uh, silkyd.com uh, or either uh, ladylikeentertainment.com. So, or one such queen, right? We gotta own so many dot coms. That's awesome. Yeah. But wow. if you like, Google me. Absolutely. Yeah, Google me, Delphine Silky D. Williams. And you'll find over 40 pages, right? You'll find over 40 pages of everything that I'm doing and everything that I do for the youth and the community. 
Awesome. Awesome. DJ Silky D, Music and C, we're at NAMM 2023.